probably a great time to be able to head indoors, maybe take in a gallery or two, uh, take part in Festival X. A uh, great uh, exhibit going on, lots of amazing photographers. Joining us, one of them who's taking part, uh, Louis Helbig. Great to have you here on the show. And uh, I would say uh, pilot and photographer. Slash, most of your stuff comes from aerial views, is that right? That's right. I'm an aerial art photographer. I fly around with my antique airplane and uh, take these largely abstract images uh, around here, around Ottawa and in different parts of the country. And uh, um, I do different projects. So one of them is down in the St. Lawrence River, sunken villages uh, near, uh, near Cornwall. Other things out in Alberta, the tar sands, oil sands, but a, a whole mix of imagery, yeah. Uh, it's really it's really interesting. I think we'll start to see some pictures uh, come up. For you, what does this festival entail? Because there's there's artists from all over the country and even around the world who have uh, things being shown. Yeah, this is a really neat thing. Uh, normally we have to go off to sort of New York or to, to Toronto or Montreal or wherever to uh, to show. And uh, this biannual event here is a, is a you know, great event. There's, a, there's 147 artists, uh, regional, international artists who are going to be here. Uh, 34 venues, uh, 18 events, uh, there's films, there's portfolio reviews, et cetera, et cetera. So I'd really encourage folks if they have a chance to get out uh, over the next 10 days, we're on until the 30th, uh, different venues, different talks uh, all around the city and, and in Gatineau too. So I think, you know, checking out the website festivalx.ca, you'd get an idea of where things are taking part because with that many venues and that many artists, you want to be able to break down as to... How oh see yeah, everything. the festival is actually quite well organized, and there's a there's a brochure uh, with a nice map on it, and it shows where the different places are, and uh, there are uh, private venues and public venues. Uh, so there's kind of a really neat thing going on here in the in the city with uh, different artists get you know and uh, and new venues coming on coming the, into play. The basis is the the pictures, right? So it's all being done photographs, and then it's the medium that in which they print it, or how they print, or the canvas that it's shown on. Is that you'll see everything? There there is a whole it's a whole art form, and uh, one of the central places is the School of Photographic Arts Ottawa mm -hmm. down here in Dalhousie in the market, and uh, where there's some really neat creativity coming out of there. And it does the range, like from old-fashioned photography with you know with film and uh, digital photos, uh, printmaking, you name it, and all of that is reflected in uh, in this festival. What are we looking at here? There's a variety of pictures that are being shown. Yeah, this is one of my <coughs> images. It's uh, an aerial shot. It's out in Alberta uh, from the tar sands, oil sands, and uh, that one is called Bitumen Slick. It's a very abstract image. It's it's documentary. It's real, as photographs are. But it's also because I parsed it right down when I was doing the doing the photography. It looks like something almost uh, otherworldly. It does, but yet yeah, that's what you were able to see now. This <laughs> is uh, this is a trailer park in Fort McMurray. Uh, this is one of the things that's on show at Altariers, where I'm doing my presentation or my uh, my exhibition uh, for the for Festival X. And uh, yeah, it's this wonderful sort of curvaceous uh, 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 trailer court of, of uh, trailers up in Fort Mac. That is out of Calabogie, um, down on the lake there. And uh, that's just near the fall, which is a wonderful time for me to go and fly and photograph. And uh, there is like these snowmobile trails out on, the, out on the ice. This one is called Stelco Steel Mill. And it's a big pile of, uh, of iron ore that's been deposited at the, at the big plant down in uh, Natacoke, Ontario. Just an amazing, amazing that's place to photograph. That's just really cool to be able to see it from that, that it, perspective. Uh, yeah, thank you. Yeah. It, uh, that, and this one here, this is, uh, this is called Sulphur and Snow. It's one of the Tar Sand series, Beautiful Destruction. And uh, that's a huge pile of, of sulphur. I shot this in January this year. And then there's some snow off to the side. So just amazing in terms of incredibly colorful place. Yeah. And this is just an example. I mean, your stuff is, uh, is really cool to see. Uh, just one of 147? There's, there's 147 artists. Uh, there are 34 venues and uh, 18 events. Things got uh, underway. The opening was last night. It runs right through until the 30th. Uh, festivalx.ca is the website you'll want to go to. As we mentioned, there's a brochure with maps as to all the locations. Uh, and the uh, X Central is at St. Bridget's Center for the Arts. Uh, thanks so much. It was great to meet you and see your work.